Hey, so what? We got on the same motherfucking shirt from last week. <laughs> so what? Shit, we don't give a fuck. We fly in the fucking fry house. Once again, man, we live at Real Steel Barn Grill, man. Shout out yeah. to Big Mike, man. I'm your boy, Tony the Millionaire, man. Curtis Kane. And look, we got 365 on the stage with us. Yes, yeah. sir. Yeah, hey man, talk to him. Kurt, what's happening, bro? Hey man, we here, man. Real Steel Barn Grill, man. Eat some good chicken wings, man. Throw the bones all over the stage. See hey, what you say? The rice. The rice. The rice, the rice. <laughs> I can, the rice. I can't say it like you. You say eat the eat the rice. <laughs> yeah, that's what's up. Only a fat nigga can say it like that. Hold up, wait a minute. I'm slim, nigga. You don't see all this. You don't see all this. Fuck, you talking about fat, nigga? I'm slim and trail. Fuck, you talking about y'all? Hater, it, hater, jealous. My body look real good and scrumptious. Fuck, you talking about? Okay, so if that's the case, then we gonna drop some music, and I want you to twerk from the front. Fuck you, man. <laughs> you said my ass on the front? Ain't that like a bitch? <laughs> oh, boot my buggy head ass. Look at that bitch. But hey, like we told y'all last week, man. Hey, Fred House, DJ Jelly. We got something big coming for y'all, man. Coming soon. So stay yeah, yeah, tapped yeah. in. Just in case y'all didn't know, man. Fred House, DJ Jelly. Hey, it's about to be big. It's up in the stuck, man. So stay oh, following. No, no. Go like, share, subscribe. Tell a friend, tell a friend. Run them tabs up, man. Like, 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 and tap the fuck in, you dig? Yeah, man, it don't cost you nothing, man. Subscribe, subscribe. All you gotta do is click that button, man. Subscribe, you don't hit gotta that watch, like button. Just hit the you like. You know what I'm saying? Fuck All you mean. gotta do is just don't be a hater. That's it. You know what I mean? What are you talking about? If you ain't got no fingers, use your nose. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, for sure. I don't know about that. That sounded kind of just tapping with Like you know? Rudolph. Saying, like Rudolph. Just saying, you ain't got like no a chicken head, so bird, mean, you pecking. You can't tap Just peck the button. Like, just peck the goddamn button. Ain't that what you say? Just push <laughs> the button. Just <laughs> peck the button. You ain't got no fingers. You gonna punch the motherfucker? And you, you, you can peck it. Use your nose. Use an eye. Fuck it. Put something on it. You know what I'm saying? Put a, put a ring on it. No, no, fuck it. Use your eye. I don't know. I don't know how your eye going to tap the light button. <laughs> I know there, I know a way to not use my nose, fingers, or nothing to tap on something. Don't use your tongue. I ain't even gonna speak on that because I don't want to get nasty like that. Oh, right, just lick the goddamn phone, I guess. I'll just... I got another extension of my body I could tap on it with. Oh, so you want to use your toes? No. <laughs> your long ass motherfucking no. toes and fingers. <laughs> Eat the no, I want to use something longer than that. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck you talking about. Come on, man. Yeah, y'all. Yeah, y'all don't, yeah, yeah, don't want to talk about that. Fuck no. What yeah. the fuck we want to talk about that for? Yeah, fuck I, you mean? I know y'all know. Why yeah. would we? Yeah. Yeah. No. <laughs> we in, and, and that just show we in the front house. Nasty, yes, for, for sure. What the fuck you talking that, about, y'all? That's what's up. Ugh. That's what's up. Hit the bip, 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 bip. Oh, right. What the fuck? <laughs> Shit. That just let him know. You watching Frat House 11, man. Always spell the frat with them double A's, yeah, man. It's going on that YouTube. Yeah. Oh, Same hold thing up. everywhere. Check what? Y'all, if y'all didn't see the performance of 365 last week, man, at O'Reilly's, man, y'all need to go check that shit out, too, man. Yeah. You did? So, hey, it's going to be 365, no sense. In the motherfucking building yes, right sir. now. And if you did not catch it, man, that brother, he, he do his thing. I feel bad for you if you didn't catch it. I, just, I do. Yeah, he I do his bad. thing. He all right. You know what I'm saying? I feel bad for you. <laughs> I'm about to sing. Hold up. No, I'm just fucking with y'all. <laughs> hey, but look, y'all. We got a live show for y'all tonight, man. Tony hey, did it. Hey, it's going to be Damn lit. Right. Hey. <laughs> We got an artist in this motherfucker, man. Oh, after, yeah, for after sure. After this break, man, we coming back. And y'all know how we doing the fry house. We turn the fuck up. You already thing, know we is. keep dope artists. We keep dope guests in the building, yeah. man. You know we turn the fuck up. Make sure y'all check sure. in with the fry house every other Wednesday, man. Every second and fourth Wednesday. 
in this bitch, man. We back, man. We coming. We got some shit coming. Hey, stay tuned. Dude. Real Stop Steel this, Sports man. Bar and Grill every yes, second sir. and fourth Wednesday. Decatur where it's greater, yeah. man. Wesley Chapel Road. We here, baby. Yeah, Let's yeah. get it. With the good chicken yeah. and the good rice. We be right back. Hey, ah. hey y'all come back now. Cause... What's up? What's going on, man? Y'all already know, man. It's your man, Curtis Kane. And it's your boy, 365. No sense. You gotta say the no sense. You know he ain't got no sense. You know what I'm I saying? Was, I was dropped on my kid. On oh. my head as a kid. As a baby. You what? As soon as I came out the womb, the doctor just dropped. Fuck you, you, that. We ain't gonna glaze past yeah. that. You said you was dropped on your kid. That's what you said, ma. <laughs> we ain't gonna glaze past that. Like we ain't heard what you had motherfucking said. You said you was dropped on your motherfucking kid. What <laughs> kind of shit is that? I did. I did. I did. See, they gonna got try to keep talking like we ain't hear that. <laughs> See, we heard that motherfucker. I'm glad your ears work. <laughs> dropped on his kids and his head. Yes, I was dropped on my kid and head as a baby. <laughs> That's what we had with. Hey, listen, man. <laughs> Y'all crazy as hell. Hey, we at Real Steel Sports Bar and Grill, man. We feeling good, man. My next guest is a motherfucking boss. You know what I'm saying? We got a boss lady in the motherfucking building, man. Cincinnati, Ohio representative, man. I love when the Midwest come through because I'm a Detroit dude. So I love the Midwest in the building, man. We got your girl in here, man. Straight gangster, straight by her business, straight by her mommy. The money hungry bitch herself. We got Miss Meek. M-H-B-E-N-T. Yeah, Miss Meek in the building. What's up? What's going on with you guys tonight? What's up? I'm feeling good. I'm feeling blessed. Thank you, God. You looking great. Thank you. I appreciate that. Got your Falcons colors on. Did you know? Did you know you was falconed out tonight? Hey, I didn't even think. You ain't even thinking about that, did you? You but got you, you looking fly as hell. You got the black and red on. You know what I mean? He said, I love them boots <laughs> for real, for real. Shane Justice, Shane Justice. That's some yeah. shit. That, that, them, them boots are something else for real. I appreciate that. You can always tell a boss <laughs> by the boots. Exactly. Especially a, a especially a lady boss. I love looking at the boots. That's what's up. That's, That's what's up. How you I appreciate been? that. I don't, you know, I'm just doing me really, you know, so. Nah, you looking good, good baby. I've been good. I've been good. Just How you doing? Keeping my head above water, you feel me? Stand down for the come up. Hold on, I heard you say something about some boots. Kick them things up. Let's see them things. You got to check the boots out. Hey, shoot cam. Yeah. <laughs> one more again. Let me see. One more. Boot hey. cam. Boot yes, cam. Sir. Yes, sir. They hurt. They get in your ass. <laughs> Boot cam. <laughs> hey, you been so funny. Look at you look like hooves. <laughs> you look like... No, hey bro, how you gonna how you gonna just discredit my? I got on black Tim's, man. Oh, I, I thought they was horse feet. <laughs> he said he thought they was hooves. He just gonna discredit my black Tim's, man. Hey, I like them. I ain't never had a they, pair of black Tim's. I'm going to give you some. Them, they, them, they don't them. compare to Miss Meek boots, but damn, I still got on some good boots. They cute. <laughs> Shit, they suede. <laughs> they cute. <laughs> And nope. they sway, but you just shitting on my shit. Like they that. cute, my bad. They are cute. <laughs> Your Tims cute. are really cute, my bad. Oh, God. Coming from you, that's not a compliment. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I hate it here. <laughs> oh, 
Miss Meek, what's up, baby? What's up, y'all? So funny. Y'all need to do I, I know time. we stupid. I know we stupid. <laughs> Oh, but, man. hey, we we glad to have you in the building. Thank y'all you know so much man. for having me in the building, you know. Hey, you I, I got to start off with where you from, Cincinnati, Ohio. Mm -hmm. You I'm know what I'm saying? Cause, yeah, because you from the Midwest, you know what I'm saying? So, we, we got it. We got it. What you say? Are you a LeBron fan? I mean, yeah, I rock with him. So I like you wouldn't want to keep burning jerseys in the first place? I mean, I'm gonna be buying jerseys, but I rock with it. You know no, he said burning jerseys. Burn. Oh no, I ain't gonna be when, when he left, when he left. <laughs> you know, nah, I ain't, I ain't pressed, cause at the end of the day, that's kind of my situation now. You feel me? We, we, we. So you gonna burn my jersey? You gonna burn my mixtape? Cause I had to I elevate. I feel you, though. So, I nah, I wouldn't do him like that. Say, hey, you, I mean, my shit. Hey, you <laughs> Right, that's a waste. Like that's why I wouldn't even be buying nothing. <laughs> so I gotta start there, Cincinnati, Ohio. You know what I'm saying? I I know that's a serious place, cause shit. I I only passed through there and knew that shit was serious. I got I told you this too. I you know what I'm saying? We was kicking it one time. I t I told you a little bit. I was at a Greyhound station just on a layover. And I'm looking at the hood, yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm from yeah. Detroit, so I know the hood. I'm looking at the hood. I'm like, I was scared to go across the street. I was like, <laughs> and I was hungry, too. I'm at the Greyhound station. I got a layover, and I looked over there, and I was like, I'm not going over there. <laughs> like, <laughs> Man, it is rough and, it's little. We, and we was in the Natty by that Greyhound station. Yeah, you know where that, that's, that's at? That's on downtown. Yeah. So I was like, around, what what time was that? Cause, Cause they done remodeled some stuff. It like it was like it was late. That's why I said I ain't going over there. Cause it like, was what like year was this? it was like one or two in the morning type oh, shit. That's, that's not a good time. But you what, know like what year? Mean? You remember what year? Oh man, I don't remember. Cause back what year. in the time, like about six years ago, it this was, was real like, bad. Uh, I I want to say like this had to be early two thousands. Oh, it was real about. bad. Yeah, yeah, that was real bad. Back Early two thousand. Yeah. yeah, that was real bad. Yeah, it was. It I was, was bad. Young girl, but I know it was. Yeah, it it was bad. It was bad. I don't want to give away my age, but yeah, <laughs> I'm a grown ass man, and I'm from the hood, and I I ain't want to cross the street. That's crazy. But yeah. coming from Cincinnati, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm assuming, you know what I'm saying, because I heard some of your music i heard what you talk about you know what i'm saying you say you let us know in your music you from the hood you know what i'm saying so coming from that type of environment like how first of all how was that and when did you come here you know what i'm saying how was your upbringing there, and then when did you come here? Well, you know, like everybody say, I, honestly, like my career and stuff, because my upbringing, the career came a little after, you know, the upbringing. So it was, it's, it's, it's challenging, really. I mean, the, the family structure, and I think that's everywhere with black community. You feel me? We all deal with our family structure being broken. So, you know, we. It just start becoming envy and jealous and energies and you know we just um, separate. It separates us. You feel me? So m more like think about having a business than you already being separated without even being successful. You get me? So then you start becoming successful. It get worse. So that's kind of yeah. like you get the love and support. People wish you well and stuff. But it's like when they start happening for you. That's why I fuck with Lucci because they say well they want Lucci bigger ranking. You feel me? Because he say, you know, they wish you well, but they don't really want well for you. Right. Because sure. when you get well, it's like, that that make them mad. Like, damn, you wanted me to stay ill? That's how I feel. So, right. you know, I feel like I couldn't heal where I got sick. You get me? You can't, I couldn't heal in that environment. So that's really what transitioned me from here. So, you know, it was tough, rough, because it's small. You know, everybody neck to neck. So when you're trying to do something, the next person might try to do it better than you. You feel me? You got these J's on. They might go try to get them. You know, then you in the club. Everybody look alike. So it, our city just likes them. It's a competition with everything. You know, even the littlest thing. And I knew God had something big for me because when I moved here, 
bigger doors open. I feel like I won't be able to get these blessings and do these things if I was still there. So that's kind of my situation with that. So with that being said, like, do you feel like, do you feel like you started really succeeding there first and then came here? Or, or do you feel like the transition was made when you came here? Like, was you already on there? Or did, did really you feel like you was popping when you got here? See, the thing is, I felt a lot of, I felt counted out in my city. Cause I felt at the time I'm a big girl, you know, they was putting out a little skinny girls out of rah-rah. Like I got a story. I, when I rap, I love my music. My music motivate me. When yeah. I feel like I'm falling off, I play my music and I get back up. You feel me? So yeah. I, I can imagine the uh, effect it put on others. So you feel me? They knew I had it. You know what I'm saying? They right. knew. They knew what was up. But they. I feel like I would be farther if they would have really pushed me and would have really been behind me. If they were supporting you. Yeah, a lot more than they do. Some people that ain't even pushing now. You feel so, me? I'm so, still out, and they and I ain't gonna lie, I've been out eight years. And I will, I, I, I put myself on 2014, had my first mixtape release, 16 songs, I, I was can, tripping. I can relate to so, that, so you feel, I'm gonna say what you <laughs> can't say. You ahead. feel like you been that bitch, but your city wasn't supporting you like that when you first was getting down yeah. like that. You know she is, she feel like she can say that, that's why it's yeah. MHB, yeah. money hungry bitch, yeah. Yeah. get in. Yeah. That's, nah, that's my lifestyle No, nah, but she's that's saying it now, but what, she's, what she was saying was, they wasn't really supporting yeah, her when she was first becoming well, I should have been, for real. Yeah, it, was, yeah. it was like, for example, this really happened. They had a big event, I mean, at the biggest club, all the love, because uh, I don't feel like nobody was big, we all in the same boat. You feel me? But they was they had the ones that was out longer than me. You feel me? And some of the ones that probably was they was pushing more than me mm -hmm. at the big event. Meanwhile, I was booked at a little, you know, party, crazy, like right around the corner from them. So they, it's like when you move the curtain for real from the big screen, you see me. Yeah. So they really right. counting me out because I'm right there for real. You get me? You're right, right. Like, and that now it's like they gotta. I don't even say they gotta watch me because they ain't got to, but they choose to. Right. Feel right. Me? right. Yeah. Oh yeah, you know, nine times out of ten, you already know they hate me. I mean, I get a lot of that, and I feel that, and I think like my heart it it, it, it irritates me because what I've been through. Yeah. Like only if I can really tell the story, I won't be hating so bad. Oh, you we feel gonna, me? So we so, gonna get to it, but we gonna do not, that as not, exclusive, not tonight. But I'm just saying, like, yeah. but you get, know, I'm just saying, like, people be hating, not knowing what people go through. You feel me or not yeah. knowing what. Like, cause exactly. I ain't choose this shit. That's why when he's, that's why I love my voice now. Now it makes sense. Yeah. Cause it's like, I, now I'm different. You feel me? You can't yeah. even copy that. They used to copy my hair, my nails, skinny hoes. You feel me? I'm in the <laughs> club. I'm rapping. I kick my leg. They go on after me. So happen all the time. I do these open mics. These, these people go on after me. Cause they, you feel me? They want to make sure I'm done before somebody get there. Never know. Right. I just feel, it, was, it, it makes sense today. Everything right. Everything makes right. sense. Right. I, I ain't mad it. at him because I would have hated me too. What, why you say that though? You would have I mean, because you. you can't stop the girl. Yeah. Nothing you do to the girl, stop the girl, made her just rise above you now. All right. Well, we're going to take a quick <laughs> pause for a second. We're going to take a quick break and we're going to come back with Miss Meek. You heard? Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, we back, we back, baby. Frat House, you watching Frat House 11, man. We back with Miss Me. Yeah, in my bag. In my bag. All up in. Yes, <laughs> yes, yes. I love you. that joint, man. Feel me? Bardo. Hey, huh? he, he's Bardo. You said what? Bardo. Oh. As long as I, if I had it, I'd give it to you. I'm about to say, no, I owe you, you won't be broke, but I don't owe you nothing. So. Damn, I can't even get no. She don't, she don't carry no small bills. She don't carry, no, big, she don't carry no small bills like that, man. Too many big bills in the bag. I can't even get that. Yeah, y'all funny. Yeah, manifest it for me, for real. Speak it. So listen, the music. Mm -hmm. So we can get into the music right now. Like, that was one of them. In my bag. Um, 
Well, I actually have a mixtape that I dropped, I'm gonna say probably like three years ago. It's on my mixtapes. It's called Gotta Get It Mixtape Part One. You know, I got 10 tracks, a few, like two features, but I dropped that probably like three years ago, four years ago. And I'm actually working on another one. Uh, it's finished. I'm just, you know, touching it up for everybody, but I got some music out. Okay. Oh, you okay. definitely do. I done, I done listened to some too. Um, in my bag from the bottom. Oh yeah. I I really fuck with that because like I feel like that defines your whole shit. Like that that from the bottom joint when I heard that, I felt like you going from the bottom to the top because I'm seeing everything you doing right now. Every time I see you fly with it, you on some boss shit all the way up. Like <laughs> So, uh, talk talk about that joint, like, from the bottom and what that means to you right now and your journey all the way up. So, from the bottom, when I wrote that, you know, I, I was in my feelings, you know, because it's really true. Like, it's really a story, and I just try to, like, narrow it down as much as I could, but... Um, and just reflect on where I came from, like you were saying. I wanted to really tell them, because like I told you, I felt capped out so much, and I'm like, only if people knew where I came from and what I had to go through, they wouldn't hate, you get me? But right. maybe it's that anointing and that light God give me that make the enemy hate it, and if they so full of evil, that's probably why they be hating on me, because I really came from a struggle, you feel me? But it wasn't always, you know, a struggle, because we had good times, you know? My mama was a hustler, you know? my my um. Her husband, my stepdad, you know, my father, you know, they all was hustlers. Like, so all the parents that I can speak of that was in my life, they just had rough times sometimes. Like, we, you know, I'm a woman yeah. now. I deal with shit. So I, but it, it could have been a lot better too. You know, it could have been better choices made to make our future brighter. You know, it made yeah. things more, more, because I don't want to keep just saying, like, oh, we, we came from nothing. It hurts people's feelings. I don't, my family see this. I don't want y'all to be hurt. Cause I can go in debt, but you know, overall, yeah. my mom was a hustler. You know, she just graduated college. You know, she in her fifties. Congratulate to her. You know, so. And, 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 that's what's up. She back to school. Yeah, she cause we got points to prove. I feel. That's what's up. I feel she got a point. She had a point to prove, and yeah. we got she got grandkids now. I got nieces. You know, we got a, they people want to be hard headed, think the streets is where it's at. So right. we, we trying to show them like. It's not where it's at. Look what we got to do exactly. to get out of them. So that's the reason why I go so hard, too. Yeah, that's a fact, man. And you going from the bottom, you definitely going to the top. What, coming from that kind of background, what, what do you feel like gives you the strength and the resilience to continue on coming from that kind of background? Like, how come you don't give up, like, what gives you that strength? Where, where do you feel like you got that strength from to continue on? Because you came like to a whole nother state on your own after coming from all of that, you know what I'm saying? Coming down here, coming to the A on your own completely with no help, you know what I'm saying? Because I, you know what I'm saying? I did my research, I read you ain't I had see. no help. You a new artist, you coming on your own. After, where do you feel like, where do you feel like your strength and your resilience come from? Because I gave up plenty of times, you feel me? Like at the beginning I gave up. When I first dropped my first mixtape, the devil hit me so hard I gave up. But what pushes me, my brother, you know he got murdered in 2015, fast friends, you know? So that's why I could be alone because I feel safe. And just just the kids and, and knowing that this vision I got, it get bigger the closer I move. Like the more I go harder, it, it, it's letting me know, I'm, it's confirming me that I'm getting closer. Where, where was you at when your brother passed? Back was, in Ohio. With, were you in Ohio? Yeah, this was in 2015. Okay, so this was before you came in? Yeah, I moved here uh, in 2020 during the pandemic. Okay. okay. Yeah. Right before 2021, I moved here. But um, yeah, just my brother, the losses. So since you the count it out, basically, I got I feel like I got a point to prove to myself. So since you, know? you since you've been here, how how have it been? Have you met people that uh, 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's in front of my brace. My bad. Damn it, man. <laughs> it's okay. Oh, my God. Hey, you know. Is it mine? Okay. Yeah, that's you. Or something. Yeah. But anyway. <laughs> so, since you've been here, how have it been? Like, have you met, like, genuine people, real people, or you still moving solo? Well, you know, I did... I do try to connect, you know, because I'm a, a networker. That's be, that's kind of where I got here, you know what I'm saying? Cause networking, you know, I networked up north, Midwest, Ohio, all through it. But I I, I have to pray a lot for that spirit of discernment, you know, because I be, I'm from the like, like you said, from the bottom. I really came from like streets, the trenches. Without the trenches, you know, I don't want to brag and boast because that ain't something to laugh about. Because I, yeah, I really no, experienced I, some things yeah, that. Been through Ohio. Yeah, you gave me so long story yeah. short. Um, I, I got that, that intuition, so it's like, I do have to dodge bullets here, for one, you know. Yeah. Um, it is faster, I feel, because, you know, some people fast talk you like they say, the open mics and the, the all these pay this, pay that, pay. Like, I know you got to invest in yourself. That's how I got this far. Yeah. And I ain't spend no cheap dollars. I, I'm probably about 80000 in just for eight years, you know what I'm yeah. saying, or more. Never know, but... I don't, I, it, 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 you can get scammed, you know, basically what I'm trying to say if you let them, but yeah, overall, yeah. the love, the support, I have networked, rubbed shoulders, with, like I just did tonight with a legend, shout out to DJ Jelly, that was amazing to meet you, but, like, it, it gave me an experience, I feel good, like, I, I do feel like it's more opportunities, you know, because I'm being able to connect and network with a lot of more people that, yeah. that's really, like, in this game, like, my city is like practice. It's nothing there. No plug, yeah. nothing. Go get me nowhere. But I mean, it, it probably is, but people, like, we from Detroit. Yeah. And people be plugged in, but they don't want to uh, connect people. You know what I'm saying? It's like they scared or, like, you're going to do better than them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh, is that so, what that is? Yeah. Like, people, like, if you good, they're like, oh, yeah, you good, but I'm going to fuck over you because you better than me. You know what I'm saying? See, and I feel like that a little bit too with the clout. Like it, I'm dealing with a, I, 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 I say I think it's the stage I'm in because like some guy did me because I'm in nursing, you know, and he was at the nurse home, the older man. He was like, he's going to take you through every step. Yeah. You know, so I've kind of took that serious in my heart because it's like this might be that step I'm on where clout chasing is it's very high because it's like I'm a hustler. I ain't gonna yeah. cap to you. I'm gonna be. I I I, I will sell water to a whale. You get me? Yeah. I'm a hustler, money hungry bitch. It's not that I'm rich. It's a hustle. I'm coming from nothing, and I gotta get it. Yeah. You feel me? So when people be like, "Oh, money hungry," yeah, I'm not rich, but I'm getting there. Yeah. Cause I'm a hustle to get Every, it. Everything Besides you look my, at is is money to be made. Right. And then I, I'm a rapper. Like once I realized that the music really chose me, and I really it's like part of me, and without it, I feel empty. Yeah. I put it into my life, and that's where MHB came from my working and my graduating colleges and, and in my career. So besides so rapping, one. what 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 are you? What else are you into besides uh, rapping and the music? Uh, well, I do insurance. I'm a life insurance agent. Um, I'm the owner of Meek Minks. It's a business eyelash and a lip gloss business that I run. Um, I am a nurse. I'm in nursing. Getting ready to graduate to be an RN. Okay, congratulations. Um, That's what's up. We got the rapping nurse in the building, y'all. So uh, see. What else? I think. Did I say anything? Yes. yes. Hey. And I'm a dog mom too, so. Hey, look, we gonna be like money hungry bitch boss nurse. Get in. Slash <laughs> esthetician, you know. Okay, see. Miss Mika all around hustling. Yeah. yeah. That's why I say I just got to get it. That's Entrepreneur. My, that's, that's what what's up. make me hungry. You know, losing my brother at a young age, we was very close. You feel me? We was both the same. And, like, my flyness is my personality. That's what, like, I don't try to be a bad bitch. This me. Like, you feel yeah, me? This is how I always I been. I'll be, be like, damn. Long time. Long time. You, you a whole not. gangster, too. I know a goddamn gangster when I see you. Yeah, you already know it. What like, that bitch say? You with silence. Yeah. Yeah, man. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm really a woman, though. I just been through a lot, and I guess I must carry it. Miss Mika say, mm -hmm. you know, say some nice words to 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 me over here, and then slap a bitch at the same time over here. Shut hey. up, bitch. <laughs> Smacking the bitch while she talking good to she, you. Yeah. She, yeah. Yeah. she, she gangsta gangsta on the left hand. I promise you, if a bitch interrupt her while she talking to me, she'd be like, "Shut up, bitch." 
back. <laughs> and won't miss a beat. Be right. talking, like I said, I be yeah, and uh, what I had I to say. Have those, I can have them scrubs at work, and they say I look like a rapper. Yeah. Like, how do I look like a rapper and I have them scrubs? They be like, you really you, do look you like You got that rapper. whole persona, yeah. like, for real, for real. Hell yeah. But I don't that, even that's care to up, do this man. shit, though. Y'all don't even understand. Like, I don't, I'm not pressed. Hey, and I want to give you a shout out on, on uh, camera, because, you know, we met you, uh, was it last year, earlier this year? Yeah, we we at been mad, awards. but we yeah, up the awards. Yeah, awards. you got to award and you uh fucked the stage up. Yeah, yeah. I know? got uh, another one after that too. Oh, for but, real? Yeah, that was with HHF. Okay. And then I just won Female Rap Hustle of the Year um back in what was that April? Yeah. But, uh, I'm in September. Sorry, it's just recently September with uh Atlanta's Hip Hop Awards. Okay. Yeah. So that's my second one with them. Last year I won Slept On. Okay, yeah, that's what's up. See, hard work pays off. You know, somebody watching you. I know, I feel it every day, but you, you know, know, I, I, I'm. You don't want to fast. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to fast. You want to, you want to walk up. The it stage. ain't gonna you be fast though. Fast. The shit I've been through, I ain't gonna cap to you. It ain't gonna yeah. be fast. It's gonna be right on time. So right, tell me, definitely. tell me about the, uh, tell me about the acting thing. Oh, that. Um, oh. I forgot tell, about tell that. Me, oh, I'm an actress too. Tell Sorry. me about, tell me about your <laughs> recent audition with. Uh, uh, Lil Legend. Scrappy, uh, Bo Hagen, Lil John, uh, Crunksville. Okay. Tell, tell me about that recent audition, because, uh, you know what I'm saying, I read about that. How did that shit go? Oh, it was amazing. I actually liked it. I got to meet Don P., you know, I remember Trillville. You know, I, I got to meet uh, King June. He's a big pro uh, movie producer, director, and an uh, artist, you know. And there's a few more people I got to meet that I don't really um, know names, but I know they're big, and I, yeah. I just appreciate their time. They was very welcoming, you know. That was actually my first time actually auditioning for a movie, because you know I'm in four films already, but that was my first time. I had to sit there and come up with a uh, monologue, you know, and actually say it in front of them. It was and had amazing. had to do a real audition. Yeah, it was amazing. What was that experience like? It was actually, I was a little nervous when I got in there, but just that's something I started doing. I got very good self motivation and good self discipline. I, I'm very good with that, so I had to talk to myself like, "Girl, we get, we wait, we gotta get it." You know, so I had to shake it off. Then I sing one, 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 and I just went straight through that motherfucker and just did it. Oh, I ain't got nothing to lose. So, what well, what do you feel like the outcome of the audition was? Do you do you know if you got the part or are you still waiting to find out? Well, I don't know, honestly, because they I, they did say they'll reach out, so you know we just did it. They, they had so many people there, there ain't no telling, you know. But I know the I did reach out because I'm a business person. Plus, I do appreciate anybody's time that they have with me. So I just told them, you know, the next day I appreciate their time and they hit me up, told me I was talented, and one of them told me make sure I come for future movies too, you know. So. So after you said to your inner self, fuck it, you know what I'm saying, I'm here, I'm, I'm going to let it all hang out, how you feel like you did? I feel like I did good. I, I'll show you actually when we're done because I recorded it. But I feel like I did good. For real? Mm -hmm. And I, was, I, I just did freestyle it. Did, did they give you any kind of lines? Or yeah, he did. They, they gave you a script? He didn't give us no script, but he went over like a little skit with us. like. So he he did one of them about us like getting fired. Then he did one about winning the lottery. Oh, okay. So they was, they was letting you know what the scenes were, basically. But I had to act on it. He didn't give me no paper. Like, what to say with him. He okay. just gave me like the, what we're going to discuss. Okay. Yeah, he emphasized. And, and then let you do your thing based on what you knew about the scene. Yeah, about the topic, basically. Okay, yeah. that's what's up. And you feel like you, you did your thing? Yeah, because, I mean, the next day he said, I mean, because I, I reached out that next afternoon, like, thank God for your time. Appreciate everything, you know. And he, um, I didn't say looking forward to hearing from you, none of that. I'm not a pass. I just really appreciate your time, you know. And um, the, the main guy that, I, that posted it that I knew of, he had wrote back like, you doing good. You did good and you talented. And then the other one wrote back That's and told me, come, make sure I come back for future projects and stuff too, the audition. Okay, so how do you feel about the acting thing? Like, not just that situation, yeah. but even before that, like. Well, you know, I'm in four films acting different 
type characters in them. Yeah, that, how do you feel gotta about watch it? Though, I'm actually in the Cater Words Greater web series too. Do, do you like it? Yeah, I love like, it. How I do you like feel it. about I acting? Because, like I, I mean, I feel like it's part of my personality. Then I look at it because some of my favorite rappers from back in the day, like Tupac, you know, the Brad, right. all them, they in movies, Aaliyah. So I'm like, I was really little. My sister loved Aaliyah. I used to look up to Aaliyah. But so, the actual work of it, is it what you expected? It's you. It's work. You know, it, it's not like, I didn't expect it to be like, oh, easy and stuff, but it is work. Like, especially when you have a director that don't do like, when he did a, like the skit, when he was just like, we gonna talk about this topic. Some directors really have a script. You gotta remember, you know, you have to remember rise. Sometimes you mess up, but it's okay, but they want their script read. You know, they want yeah, it the way sure. they run it. So, depends on the director, you know, but I, overall, I like it, because I'm an entertainer. I like to, the cameras, you know, I like the, I like the. So you don't mind pushing yourself when it's time to get it? No. Like, when it comes to that? No. I'm hungry. Money hungry. <laughs> that's what's up. That's the, that's the hustling you always <laughs> huh? Yeah, I just, <laughs> I don't know what it be, but yeah, I guess. That's what's up. That's what's I up. Just push, push, push. So, you ready, my brother? My, 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 my brother, my brother 365 got a couple questions. He about to put you in the hot seat right quick. Cool. You know what I'm saying? Don't be offended. You know what I'm saying, but yeah, he about he about to come from. I don't know where he's coming from. It's okay, he I'm might gonna... come from left field. He might ask something personal. I don't know, but this segment is called the hot seat. So he about to turn it up a bit with a couple questions. You know what I'm saying, and I'm gonna turn it over to him right quick. That's fine. Mick, how you doing? I'm doing fine. You sure? Yeah, I don't, you just yeah. got me a little nervous the way you're uh, smirking. Are you ready? Are you yeah, ready? I'm ready. Are you I'm ready? down. <laughs> are you fine? I ain't got no choice. I'm here already. I ain't getting All right, so, knowing you from Cleveland, Cincinnati. Uh uh, hell no. But, yeah, you had the wrong city. <laughs> <laughs> she corrected your ass quickly. Cincinnati. <laughs> But what you been from Cincinnati and everything, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You ever caught any cases? Uh. You ever, like, had to just, you know, just, just go off the wall and say, fuck it, I'm finna beat this bitch ass, and I'm gonna kill that. What? Yes, I have. Yes, I have. And yes, and I what have. what was the occasion? Like, well, man. I'm not, like, the case really, that was, like, only criminal. I ain't gonna lie, it's more, <laughs> it's more like a ticket. It was more like a ticket, but I had somebody else take the charge, should I say. They what? took the charge for me. Yeah, it was back when I first started rapping, I was uh, decided to start managing, you know, another female, you know, because right, right, she had right. a story, too. I was trying to get real bitches, you know. So we was connected. She was part of MHB, you feel me? I put her on, and um, she ended up taking the case for me because she had just got out of jail for drugs, and my shit clean, so they was on me. Right, but right. when she said everything was hers, they let me go. Yeah. And she, um, I don't do nothing to the but bitch. She That's just, she just was proving loyalty. But the thing is, she was in jail probably before that for, t like, she fucked with me. But she, when she, I guess she fucked with you, she take the case. But she felt the same I felt. My record was clean, hers was already dirty. Ain't no point to even fuck her mind up, keep hers dirty and mine's clean, because we got shit to do. It was some weed. That's it? Some weed in a bottle. That's a that's a dog ass bitch. So she real talk. Yeah, she she that's I rock with her. She really that was, that was amazing because I was a nurse. I got shit to lose. Right. The right. question you know is, do you but still was, fuck with her? Yeah, yeah she. I mean, I still try to reach out, but um, you know, people go through things in life, but we still got good slay. Yeah. Uh, yeah okay. Like it's that, not. That's all that matters. Yeah, we good. Yeah. Yeah, we good. She still salute me because she see I'm still on my grind. Nothing stop even though things happen that could have stopped, you know, with the situation with us around back then. Just haters. Motherfucker try to snake you. So when you make it, because you're going to make it. Yeah, I know. That means you got her. Yeah, That's I got whoever. I mean, I got whoever. They I'm got you. you. I'm, I got whoever for real because I know I got that heart. Even the hater, I got you. Yeah. Because God said love your neighbor. I love you, bitch, here. Yeah, they Not like that, though. Right. But I, I, I got motherfuckers because I do want to get back. 
that's my big plan for real. Like when I get that bag, I want to get back, start changing my city. First, yeah. I'm gonna start there because they need it first. You know yeah. what I'm saying? The government ain't doing shit. Yeah. Welcome know? to the frat house. So, so I'm Miss into that. I'm really y'all. into that though. Hell yeah. Okay. That's dope. That's dope. So did I answer the question? I think I answered. You got another one for? Oh, I was. But yeah, yeah, I had and then bitches. Oh, bitches! I had my own uh, gang. I forgot that part when we was little. You know, I was in a few little gang gangs because we came from a struggle. So me and my sister we used to go outside. I ain't gonna lie. We we just went to the. We had a United Dairy Farmers. It's like a store, a dairy store that carried dairy ice cream and shit. And um. No, we'd see bitches walk, they can't even come to the store. Mm-hmm. Like, this is my store. Like, I even do it at the pool. You can't come to the pool, this is my pool, this is my part. So you own the store. But that was back then, the though, I changed today. You know, it's like, I'm not a, I don't think I was even a bully then, because it's more like we was bullying people that's young. It was teenage girls like us, young adults, like, you know what I'm saying? But, I mean, I was a fighter. You know, my knuckles healed now, but I was a fighter. But I don't do all that now. I have businesses, you know, I'm a woman. Who I mean, it with me? Like, Not somebody to fuck out. You know, we took it out a different way. Right. I mean, we had a fight for like four nights straight. Four nights in a row, rain, sleet, snow, sunny. The bitches kept coming back, getting their ass with. So, so you just around it. Cincinnati beating bitches. <laughs> back in the day. <laughs> so bitch, back bitch, in the day. <laughs> bitch, you want some beating? Back in the day, though, that was just, you know, but as in, like, I ain't had a fight in a while. You no, know, but, yeah. So what's yeah, your yeah. loss count? You said what? When I don't even know if I lost anything. No. <laughs> I blank shit. out. You were just uh, beating bitches up. Huh? I mean, I got you. Oh, I got job. My sister went to Indianapolis. It's a quick story. Uh, Indianapolis, my sister lived in. Uh, she still lived there in Naptown. But we went there and we went to a party up in North. It was a club. New Year's. We already had some issues at our house. It's irrelevant. But when we get to the club, we hype. Right. That's Cincinnati, in it? So I, and my sister, we Leos, she a Leo, I'm a Leo. So we in there looking face to face, turn, because we need our drinks. It's about to be 12 o'clock, New Year's, we just went through some shit. So we turned up. That's you know, my, so I'm very intuitive. Uh-huh. My spirit was like, go to the wall, you know, because we survival mode. Some say get in survival mode. Right. Don't know why. I'm drunk as hell, but I just go to the wall, put my back on the wall. I look up my so big sister, because I'm the baby. She turned up, walking past me, smiling, like, hey. We done met some girls who came over dance with us. So I'm like, all right, sister, I see you. I turn my head, I look over, they just hit my sister. Oh. Next thing you know, I run over there, they, they, I couldn't even get to her because I caught some bitch trying to get to her. I done dropped, dropped her. Next thing you know, I'm trying to get to her. The security dropped me. Then they throw us outside like on the movie. They threw us <laughs> right outside down. in the back. Oh, you out of here. They threw us in the back, oh, though, back man. of the <laughs> club. Wow. We come out the door, it looked like a movie because I was so used to movies and shit. But, it was a big ass tall security guard in the dumpster, and I'm like, "Where you? Where the front at? We looking for a car?" Da, 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 da. He was like, "Around that way." We turn the corner, it's at least 20 people coming to us, niggas and bitches. Wow. Damn. I had on heels. My sister had on heels. I'm like, "Bro, take these heels off." I, I turned the heel. This part facing the bitches. My heel was like this, like a weapon, cause I ain't got none. I I think I hit two bitches in the eye. Next thing you know, they hit me in the head with the bottom. Casey, Casey. We, 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 I didn't, I just left them little scratches and glass broke on my face, but I still got good because we had, we, me and my sister, it was both of us getting jumped by like 20 people and we was hitting with them. And I still had my ear in my hand, so I know. Hell yeah. So, so that was man. probably it, the, the first, because I think I ain't do, like, hey, I was fucked up. Check it. I, I got to get this from you. All right, can we get a performance before you leave? Yeah, that's, that's cool. All right. All right, tell the people where they can find you at. Y'all can find me on uh, Instagram, Twitter, you know, YouTube, Facebook, M-S-M-E-K-M-H-B. You can Google me, M-S-M-E-K-M-H-B. I pop right up. Miss me, money hungry bitch, slapping the motherfucking frat house, y'all. Hey, yeah. we'll be right back with this dope-ass performance that she about to get, y'all. You dig? And make sure y'all like, share, subscribe, man. Spell them frat with them double A's. Mm. You did. Hey, come back. Make sure you come back. I don't care what you do, man. What's up, y'all? We in that frat house. Y'all already know what time it is, man. Real Steel Sports Barn Grill, man. I got my girl with me, man. She in the motherfucking building, man. That Midwest energy, man. I love it, man, because I'm from that D-Town, man. 
We got Ohio in the building, that natty, Cincinnati, Sin City, man. We got my girl, boss bitch, money hungry bitch, Miss Meek in the building. Shout out to Frat House. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Shout out to Frat House. Curtis, appreciate that. Yes, uh, I'm going to turn up with my new sing with my single in my bag. Let's go. <laughs> what? Are you kidding me? These hoes sad. That's why, that's why I stay on my motherfucking back. I'm shitting on these bitches. I gotta make them mad. They hate to see me winning, but I'm running up a bag. Don't fuck with broke bitches, cause all them hoes back. Ain't taking chances with you. I'm that bitch, I'm in my bag. I'm shitting on these bitches. Tissue. We got hoes with issues. When I come around, had a bad mood. I'm a real bitch in my bag, too. In my bag, too, and I'm getting it. Me and them, we different. I'm on the hustle. 24 7, they laying around and they bitching. Mad at me, cause I got a bag and I get it back. I'm in my bag, bag like groceries. I'ma take the shot like Kobe. Have a flashback to the old me. I'm doing better. Lost friends, cause these hoes jealous. Fuck up a bitch, I'ma make her mad. I'm a real queen. These hoes pass the bitches. I gotta make them mad. They hate to see me win. But I'm running up a bag Don't fuck with broke bitches Cause all them hoes back Ain't taking chances with ya I'm the bitch, I'm in my bag I'm shitting on these bitches I gotta make them mad They hate to see me winning But I'm running up a bag Don't fuck with broke bitches Cause all them hoes back Ain't taking chances with ya I'm that bitch, I'm in my bag Back, 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 back Take the trip just to chill out Hop in the rental with peel out Different states, now I'm cashing out I'm doing numbers like a trap I'm in my bag, make them mad, these so sad, and they whack Trying to be like me, copycat, roger that, copy that, then have nothing, I ain't going back Got a mean hustle in my mask set, they frustrated, I ain't feel off yet Can't come around, I'm allergic, got miss me bugging that they lurking I shit on bitches on purpose Money hit you, bitch, Money I'm shitting on these bitches I gotta make them mad, they hate to see me winning, but I'm running I'm that bitch. I'm in my bag. I'm in my I'm bag. I'm in my bag. <laughs> 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 